Let's go out. And maybe we can... Oh, gosh. I don't know what level that one is. Should we try and knock that one out? And then I'll literally have like a repeat of episode one where it's like, oh, let's find out if we tame it by next episode, you guys. Let's use the blue ones because these ones are 18 times more potent than a normal trank arrow. So these two... One of these is like equivalent to two of the regular ones we were just using, right? So let's use these. Load up our bow. There you go. And I kind of want... I, I'm like, if I get close to that thing, it's going to be... Uh, it's going to be trying to attack me. So uh, can I even get on top of this rock? Maybe I need to make, like, a tower or something. Oh, yeah, I should be able to jump on this side. Yeah, there you go. Hmm. Maybe I should have got a slingshot just to get his attention and get an aggro on. Oh, well, it is bigger. Oh, there's a hit. Uh-oh. It, 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 oh, it's starting to... Oh, it's going to ram into us. Oh, no! No, 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 no! Ring around the rosy, Ada! Get out of here! Oh, oh, there's another hit. Oh, no! I'm running, I'm running, I'm running! Oh, it's coming! It's going to knock down my house! Oh no! Get in the get in this big boulder thing. Get over here. Get over here. Oh no! Da, 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 da. Holy heck! Oh no! I died still. Level eight forty. Man, that was the good one too. Holy heck! Yeah, I'll respawn there again. Oh my gosh! How's that thing doing on torpedo? I need to hurry up over there. It's probably going to be tamed here pretty soon, you guys. Holy heck! Hurry up, you big alien! Get out of here! Get up, 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 but let's make a death finder. Sheesh, how many times am I going to do this? <laughs> See, that's what I'm talking about. I just made the heckin', uh... Yeah, let's not go that way. Oh, man, look at those jellyfish looking kind of weird. <laughs> let's find out which island has, like, a thousand death beacons on it. <laughs> this series is terrible already, guys. I've died, like, pretty much, like, 15 times, I think. <laughs> I don't know. Leave a comment down below if anyone's actually bothering to keep track. How many times have I died so far? Like, holy heck. What an absolute waste. Oh, this way. Okay. But I'm uh, the torpedo is probably starting to wear out on that thing, but it, uh, we've already used a pretty good amount of those, like, potent toxic arrows or whatever they're called. So hopefully it should be, you know, pretty high up on the on the, on the the toxicity or whatever you want to call that. <laughs> so maybe it is somewhat close to being able to get tamed, right? Maybe if I'm lucky. Maybe it'll be... Maybe, maybe torpidity and stuff. Yeah, the torpidity takes forever to go away, as we saw in the Styracosaurus that we tamed. So maybe we could just literally just die like 50 more. Oh, yeah, I should be able to make the sleeping bag, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. But there is a cooldown by how many times you could use the sleeping bag, so I do need to watch out for that. All right, let's get some, uh... Oh, yeah, I, I probably should have taken a stamina break before I, uh, started swimming, because now I'm swimming and, like, I'm basically just wading in the water. <laughs> oh, man, I have no stamina right now, man! Can I stamina break in the... Yeah, I don't think you can. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We can just float to the top, and that's it. We need to get to some shallow water. Which, we might be able to slowly float our way over there, you guys, but... I think maybe the stamina, like... Drain, or whatever you want to call it? Or, uh, not stamina drain, but, uh, the torpidity drain of the Styracosaurus. I th it feels like it's super duper slow from the one that we tamed, so maybe we could just... Try and shoot that thing over and over again, maybe, like, take ten lives until it's finally knocked out. And then that'd be an insane tame, you guys, level 840. Gonna get a half the levels minus one on top of that, so that thing's gonna be... Super high level. I don't even know what that heckin' level cap is for this, you guys, so... Ooh, man, that's gonna be an absolutely amazing heckin' tame if we can get it. Look at that level 112 coelacanth right there, sheesh! Man, my creature is starting to get some heckin' facial hair. Look at that ancient alien with those black devil eyes and his weird green hair. <laughs> Kinda looks like the Hulk, but like, super scrawny looking. <laughs> Anyways, we do have a level up, so... What am I going to do? Maybe, uh, maybe another health. Like, it certainly, certainly wouldn't hurt, right? Sheesh. Anyways, just gotta go... which way? Mainly just this way, it seems. <laughs> there's so many of these heckin' death markers now. Like, look, <laughs> there's one there. There's one there. There's probably, like, two, basically, like, right next to it. Yeah, look at that. There's two, like, right there, basically. Sheesh. Uh, I don't know what the difference between the green and the... Like, per... I think the green is your most, most recent death, I think? Yeah, it looks like it. Oh, there's another green one in the background, though. What is that one for? I don't think I died over there. Huh. Well, there's that same Styracosaurus, the one that killed us, like, who knows how many, like, I don't know, like, two times. And then, of course, killed our Styracosaurus, so... Gotta get a little bit of revenge here, you guys. Anyways, it's good. Oh, yeah, I'm out of stamina again. Golly. Can I regen? Yep, I can regen right here, so that's good. Uh, there we go. Oh, I died in... Man, my dead body's, like, at the bottom of the heckin' sea. Probably gonna get a thousand megalodons over here. Oh, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up! Is it? Someone harvest me? No, I'm still alive. Look at that. I'm wearing like a witch's hat. <laughs> Let's get all the stuff. There you go. 
All right, I've got the stuff back. Oh, I used all the arrows on that thing, though. Golly. So we need to use the regular arrows now. Man. I don't, I don't think we're high enough. We might need to kill some trilobites, though. Maybe they'll drop some more of those arrows, and then we can just kind of use them over and over and over again. I don't know where I was whenever I killed those ones, though. So we might want to just go onto, like, a beach and see if one will, like, show up and then kill it, you know? But, yeah, like, right here is a fantastic cliff, you know, that... Uh, I'm saying you know a lot. <laughs> but, uh... Well, I'm not seeing arrows. We don't have any arrows? What happened to them? Did I lose them? I might have lost them, you guys. Or maybe I put them up... Oh, yeah, I think I put them up over here, right? Yeah, I think so. Let's go check. No! I think we lost them. Yeah, they're not even loaded into the thing. That one's almost broken, too. Uh-oh. That's bad news bears, you guys. Yeah, I should be able to make that thing uh, here in the future. That'd be a really good thing to hopefully tame that thing with. Golly, knock it out at least. But, ah, man. Is there a second thing over here that I didn't notice? There might be. Just because it seemed like there's like basically nothing in my inventory whenever I picked up my dead body. So let's go check real quick. Look at all that stuff in the background. Jellyfish there. They're, aren't they supposed to be in like super deep seas? So why are they so... I'm like, I'm not complaining. Because it'll make it easier for us here in the future, but... uh anything else in that? Yeah, there's literally nothing else in this guy's inventory. Look at that loser. Idiot. Who dies like that? Who just dies? <laughs> oh, there are the arrows. What in the world? Why did it not give me the arrows? I guess it's doing the weird, like, two inventory things that we've seen in the past. I guess, I guess it's just a weird, like, bug of Ark in general and not like a mod. Okay. Well, anyways, let's see when we swim back to the surface, you know, alive. <laughs> And see if, uh, let's see if we can craft any arrows or, like, trank slash potent or, oh, god, look at that megalodon. Can I kill that thing? Maybe I can't. I'm like, it's literally a water critter, so maybe I could just, uh, shoot it with a bunch of regular arrows, perhaps? Can I do that? I want to see if I can, you guys. Like, I'm a land critter, so I'm better than you. <laughs> Where is it? I can't see it. Ah. And I know you can't shoot underwater, you need a crossbow for that. Oh, wait, maybe not? Yeah, it's not letting me. Oh, there it is right there. Is it aggro? I don't think it is. Yeah, I don't think it is. It's too far away. I'm, I'm just going to give up on that right now. Kind of want to see, like, arrows. Like, what? Oh, I have 120-something uh, anger point. Pugnacia Trank Arrow? This high-end Torpor arrow works with all bows. High-end Torpor when used. Regular Trank Arrow there. One narcotic, one stone arrow, flame arrow. Fiberglass Trank Arrow. What in the world? <laughs> Improved version. Increases the victim's torpidity more faster. The normal arrows, and you can recover the arrow from bodies if you're like, oh, that's really cool. And then the other, like, upgraded ones are super, like, higher level. 28 probably for the next one, right? Yeah. What level are we right now? I don't know. 20, hey, look at that. It's, like, right around the corner. Holy heck. Now, what about the other one, though? We have three of the uh, potent trinker. I guess we could just use them on that one, right? Let's see. Where is that? Uh, there it is right there, I think. Might want to get on this cliff. <laughs> Maybe it'll work a little bit better this time on the heckin' cliff. Let's shoot it with a regular arrow just to get its attention. There we go. Alright, where is it? Where is that trash? There he is. Let's try and compensate for the distance. I don't know if I under or over. There's a hit. Alright. It's coming over here. Let's lure it over here to this cliff. He's like, oh my god, that idiot is shooting me again. What a loser! Does he not know I killed him like three times and his heckin' crater? Okay, here we go, here we go, here we go. Level 840, yep, that's the same one. That's it. Let's just shoot it with all those arrows. There we go. Then, let's see. Can I hit it from here? I don't think I can. <gasps> is it running away from Torpor? I don't think it is. I missed. Uh-oh. Kind of want to... Ooh. Let's just go. Here we 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 go. Come on. Chase it. Chase it. Chase it. Chase it. Chase it. Do not knock out in the water. Do not. Whatever. Oh, God. No. <laughs> no. Why did it attack me? It was running away. What in the world? Usually those things don't attack you when you're whenever they're running away from the torpor, but I guess that one's just too smart. Man! Well, at least maybe we made some progress on it. <laughs> Jeez! Let's grab a heckin' stone. Let's make our way back now. Golly, I'm, I'm just going to cut this out. We, we've, You guys have seen me go back to literally the heckin' same spot for like who knows how many times now, right? Golly. <laughs> I don't know why I didn't build a heckin' thing on this island. I'm gonna get spot I need to make a sleeping bag, too. I might as well. <laughs> so maybe it'll save us a trip every other death. That'd be good. Uh, but I, I feel like we made some good progress there. Might want to just make a bunch of poison trank spears. I'm like, might want to might want to avoid using the melee and just throw the spears at it. 
And that'll probably be the best bet, because we ran out of those poison arrows, as you guys saw. And I assume it retained a lot of its torpidity from last time, where it almost got knocked out, because it started running away from high torpidity, which is a good sign. So, maybe just want to keep at it <laughs> through one or two more heckin' lives, and then maybe we'll finally I can get it, golly. But yeah, before we go across this, let's take, let's take a stamina break, regain all of our stamina, there we go. And now we should swim all the way to the other side without a problem, so... Let's go back now, and let's try it around like 10 against that same Styracosaurus. Alright guys, look at this loser I just found in the heckin' water. Ugh, idiot. Who just dies? What an idiot. <laughs> let's just drop all that random trash we just picked up in skins and stuff. I don't need this garbage. Let's see if we can make any more of those, like, train. Oh gosh. Uh, oh, here he is right here. Uh, access inventory still? Nope. Uh, let me destroy the corpse. There you go. Is there another bag right there? Yeah, there's armor again. What in the world? Oh, I thought I put that on. Okay, there we go. Let's put it on that time, though. <laughs> Alright, well, I don't know what the progress is on this one. Uh, might want to see... Can I make any more of those trank, uh... Like, I have this potent knock. That's going to be great for keeping it knocked out, but... I don't think we have any, uh... I think we have two narco berries right there. 27 on our inventory. Let's see if we can make more of these spears, though. I'm going to need more wood, fiber, and flint. Let's go check over here if we have any wood fiber flint. Not there, I don't think. This one. Let's check this. Wood fiber and flint. There you go. Let's try and make some more of those spear. How many can I make? Three? Eh. Could be better. What do I need to make more, though? Probably... Probably fiber. Yeah. Fiber. Alright, let's go pick some bushes. Get some more fiber. Then we'll have some really healthy bowel movements if you catch my drift. <laughs> I'm like, I'm not really being too subtle about that, right? Golly. <laughs> Alright, I've collected a ton of fiber, even more uh, narco berries and stuff. Let's just craft two more, that's it. Uh, okay, yeah, probably just need way more narco berries then, golly. Yeah, I definitely want to make a farm here pretty soon, just so we can have like a, a steady source of heckin' whatever berry we want, mainly narco berries, maybe miho berries for taming more of these herbivores and stuff, but yeah, I, I guess if we could see like how, if we're make it, able to make the uh, trank arrows. Yeah, we're, we, we unlocked them, so yeah, let's do that for 14 things. Yeah, we can make narcotics, but we need a mortar and pestle and spoiled meat. Now, I don't know if we have any spoiled meat. I think we cooked, like, all of our meat, right? So, any meat that we have is, uh... Well, we have some right there. Yeah, some of the meat that's extra left over that I didn't cook right there, you know? Uh, I could always split these up like this. That way it's more likely that they'll, uh, spoil faster. Just have them in singular stacks like so. Get a bunch of spoiled meat this way. Or, actually, yeah, forgot about this. Split stack, split all, and then now they're all in singular stacks, and now they should all uh, spoil super duper quick. So, let's see if we can make a mortar and pestle first. Should be able to, uh, should be able to unlock it. Let's see. Yep, unlocked it at level heckin' six. Sheesh. So, there you go. Let's get an S plus version of it. I don't know about the automated arc thing. I I'll need to look into that, though, but uh, let's go to. I need 15 hide, but I should be able to do that. I think we have hide over here. Yeah, we have 65. Let's get 15 of that and some stone. And let's make ourselves a mortar and pestle. See if we can make some narcotics. There we go. Let's make the S plus, S plus version of it. And place it down here once it's done. There we go. And let's place it down like right here. There you go. Alright, now we should be able to make some, uh... I think we need to unlock... Where is it? Uh, narcotic. Oh, yeah, it's already unlocked. A plus narcotic. Self-crafting recipe requires intermediate or advanced... Ba oh, it's a thing for the backpack. That's interesting. Toxic narcotic is a little bit more potent. Uh, quite a lot more. 18 times more potent than a basic. Golly. And it requires one potent narcotic, two rare flowers, two rare mushrooms, one toxic blood, narco berry seed, narcotic, and tinto berry seed. Woo! That's interesting. Needs to be crafted in a primal smithy, though. Yeah, we need one of those before I want to even think about making those, uh, you guys. So, yeah, worry about that a little bit later. Yeah, narco berries, we need five of those and one. Yeah, so we can only make, like, one uh, arrow right now, that is. Because I think, what was it, one narcotic? for one Trank Arrow. So yeah, once that's done, we should be able to make a Narco- or a Narcotic Arrow. Or trank Arrow, golly. <laughs> there it is right there. So we can make one of those, and boom. I just need more of these Trank Spears, or Primal Spears. But of course, that, that costs uh, eight nar Narco Berries each. Let's try and, uh, let's, let's try and get the heckin' thing again. <laughs> what in the world's that thing doing? It's ice skating, holy heck. Where'd it go? Where'd the uh, Styracosaurus go? Oh gosh, oh gosh, oh gosh. What is it doing? Get away! You dumb! Okay, I'm going to make a sleeping bag because I completely forgot I wanted to make that. Ooh, I thought that thing was attacking me. Ooh, sleeping bag time. I need 25 hide. Okay, yeah, let's go grab some hide over here. Just so you know, because I'm going to die here pretty soon, so hey. 
let's get uh let's get prepared for it right so there you go sleeping bag and uh, i don't know if we can make a bed just yet might not be high enough level so let's put up the extra hide and sleeping bag is done so let's place that down right uh can i place it here nope can't do it there uh here hey there you go nice all right so now we've got a sleeping bag right there nice all right well let's load up our uh there's a what is that thing trying to attack i have no idea well let's put up that one singular trank arrow in our uh, bow and arrow or uh bow <laughs> <laughs> and let's try and find that one Styracosaurus, and then throw a few of these Trank Spears at it, and see if we can get it nice and knocked out. Just need to find it first, though, because that thing is a level 840. Don't know anything about, like, the torpidity it has, like, how we're doing, like, progress-wise. I assume we were doing really well. Where'd it go? It's, like, straight up gone. Oh, is that it? That might be it right there. I'm tired right now, though, but, uh, I don't know if there's a cl Oh, here's a cliff. Ooh, here's a good cliff. Okay, eh. I'm going to switch over to my other arrows. I'm going to switch to the normal ones. There we go. Get us attention with these. Maybe he'll come over here. I don't know if that's the right one. Okay, I got a hit right there. Switch over to that singular random primitive trank arrow. Oh, it's behind a rock. That's good. Okay, we got a hit right there. Let's get a... I don't want to get too close to it. Oh, there we go. Was it running away from Torquor now? I don't, I don't know if I want to pursue it. There's another hit with the Trank thing. I don't know if I want to get any closer. Because you guys know what just happened just moments ago. It turned around and attacked us immediately. That Pteranodon is... Ooh, it's really weird. Psychedelic colors, you guys. Holy heck. Let's get a little bit closer. It's still running away. Hopefully the Torpor is still horizon on it. Oh, oh! I missed, I think. Oh. Oh my gosh, look at that two heckin' thing sticking out of it. There we go, there's another hit. Is it coming back? Oh, I'm running, I'm running, I'm running, I'm running, I'm running! Oh, man! Oh, no, oh, it's running away, I think. It's not running towards me. Not right now, at least. Oh gosh, right as I say that. Oh god, I'm dead, I am dead. Let's go, let's go, let's go. On to the cliff! Go to the cliff, the cliff plan! I have only one more of these spears left. Oh, man! Uh-oh, oh, oh! Okay. What in the world is it doing? Oh! Well, that's the last of my spears, you guys. Oh, uh, man, I don't know how I'm going to knock it out. Hopefully it gets knocked out here pretty soon. Oh! Oh, I thought it was doing something there for a second. Man, I need to pick more of these bushes, get more narca berries. Man, this is going to take forever, you guys. But that thing is going to be an insane team if I can get it. Oh man, I, I should definitely make a farm here pretty soon too. Man, how's that thing not knocked out? Okay, I, I don't know what I'm going to do. <laughs> like, I need maybe if if I tame that other low level Styracosaurus, probably could have used it to harvest a bunch more berries, but of course it died. So I, I maybe I shouldn't be getting such a high level one straight up right now. Maybe I should wait a little bit. Maybe get another level 100. You know, a low level level 100. <laughs> Okay, there it is right there. I, I really need to be careful with this thing. Okay, it seems like it's not aggroed on us anymore, so that's great. But I do want to maybe make a farm here. How long is this? Another five hours on that. Sheesh. Alright, we'll see if we can make a uh, crop plot. Uh, medium, sure. Let's do a medium one. Because we need to be level 36 to make a large one. Sorry, because we're still right there. Okay. Well, let's, I'm like, we are like right next to the beach. Might as well just get some like water pipes and then just make a crop plot and of course it's going to take forever because we don't have any greenhouse stuff set up so whatever at least uh, whatever <laughs> uh, oh yeah we have a little bit of metal there but uh i don't think let's see hold on where was that thing i think it needs like a bunch of iron right or uh metal right yeah 119 yeah we're nowhere near <laughs> we're going to make that and we need to make it at the primal smithy so yeah that's going to be a long ways away you guys holy egg uh, we do have these random saddles, though. Oh, yeah, I never went back to get those saddles. I don't even know where they're at. They probably despawned by now. Holy heck. And I think it, I think it was nighttime whenever I got those and put them down, so I'm, who knows where they're at. <laughs> Anyways, yeah, let's, let's let's try and make a crop plot if we can. Medium, we need a little bit of thatch. Uh, any thatch over here? Yep, a little bit of thatch. Let's see if we can make a uh, crop. Yep, we can. We can get a medium one. And we're going to need irrigation pipes. So let's get irrigation pipe intake, straight, tap, and that's going to be basically it. So I don't think there's S-plus versions of that. Doesn't seem like it, at least. That kind of sucks. All right, let's, uh, 
apply this new level up to melee damage. Now we got uh, multiplier at 10, so that's great. And yep, right there I was just about to say it looks like all of our raw meat was about to spoil, and it did, so we have 159 of that. So that's going to be great for getting a few more of those narcotics, I suppose, uh, to get more of those arrows. I, I don't know how this compares to a uh, to a spear. Would it be better to get this? It has a chance to, be break, to break when used. What about a pike, a primal pike? Okay, so just a regular primal pike is 10 metal ingots, so I, I could make that. How much for the uh, primal smithy again? Let's see, 25, but I also need tw uh, 15 crystal and 45 hide. Hmm, and that, I just need to find out where crystal is. Primal pike, oh yeah, that's the thing we just looked at, yeah. And uh, we need five obsidian for that one, so, huh. Let me see, uh, let me go to regular pike. That's just a weapon, right? Yeah, it's just a weapon. Pike plus, unlike a spear, cannot be thrown. I don't know what the difference between this one and the regular pike is. That's more expensive. Oh yeah, the weapon damage. Durability is higher. Weapon damage is at 100% for baseline. Yeah, the durability just seems like that's the main thing. Is that it's just way higher. So, and of course it's more expensive as a result. Scorched Pike Plus. That's the Scorched Earth thing. So I guess you can craft it now. That's interesting. I guess now we can make the uh, the irrigation stuff. So let's make the uh, irrigation intake. The straight... Oh, can I even make that? I don't even have enough stone. What in the world? Uh, I thought I had like tons of stone or something. I guess not. Okay. I, I should probably have uh, noticed that earlier, but whatever. At least we can get some stone easily, just like literally right outside our door. Boom! 14 stone, 21 stone. That's 9 plus 10, of course. And boom! 46. Alright, let's see if we can get more irrigation stuff. And we can get a straight one and a tap. That's basically all we need, honestly. So we have the crop plot, we have the irrigation stuff. Mmm... Where should we slip this in? Like, right here, basically? Yeah, I'm like, right here is completely fine. I guess I could just take a dump real quick. Uh, oh, man, I can't dump. The, the, oh, yeah, not ready to defecate yet. Maybe we can get some stem berries and help that out. Uh, almost just eight silica pearls. Uh, here we go, stem berries. So we can poop after this. Yeah, not immediately yet. <laughs> I think I have seeds in the, uh... Yeah, I'm not seeing seeds right there. I think I have seeds in one of the chests, so... Yeah, I'm dehydrated, too. But we're, like, literally right next to water, so I don't need to worry about that, like, at all. And I probably don't even need that straight pipe, but, uh, yeah, I, I can't even use it, either. <laughs> So let's get the tap, let's put that right there, and we can drink directly out of that. Alright, noise, is that uh, irrigated? Probably takes a second. I can pick it up, I think, because it says plus, right? Let's see if it's... Yep, it's irrigated, so I don't need to worry about that, so that's great. Alright, maybe I'll move it just because there is grass in the way right there. So let's just move that, like, right here. So I can see it a little bit easier. There you go, yeah, you can see it a little bit easier there. Alright, see if we have any uh, Nargaberry seeds in here. I think we do. I think we have a little bit of seeds. For stuff. Ah, uh, never mind. Literally no Narcoberry seeds in there. What in the world? <laughs> okay. Well, you know what? I, I, I definitely need to tame a lower level creature. Maybe I'll tame that Anklo. Maybe it'll be a pretty good, uh... I'm like, it is. It is an Anklo. It was, there was a level 300, or, uh, yeah, like a level 300. I think we killed a level 100, didn't we? So, yeah, we might want to tame an ankle and then work our way up to a level 800 star agasaurus <laughs> you know maybe that's going to be our hierarchy that we're going to work on you know I, I just don't think we can do it like immediately just straight up like literally our second tame is going to be a level 800 heck creature i don't think that's going to happen you know so anyways let's just grab more stuff over here narcoberries hopefully we get more narcoberry seeds because i am just itching to plant some of those bad boys down and Start getting our crop plot, making some narcomaters, because right now it's just literally doing- I'm like, I don't even have fertilizer yet. I would have had a really good fertilizer. I just need- Ah, oh, yeah, I killed that Fiomia, didn't I? That would have been a really good poop machine. I'm like, I probably wouldn't have tamed it. Probably would have just followed it around and picked up poop, because it poops like every other second. <laughs> so might as well have just used that as a poop machine that I just kind of pick up poop from. Just, you know, just follow in its footsteps and pick up a gigantic thing of poo every now and then. But let me continue just harvesting a bunch of these bushes. See if I get any narcomary seeds and- Maybe I'll have enough just narcoberry slash narcoberry seeds to be able to make a, uh, I don't know, like a couple of those, like, poison spears and... Oh, there's a giant poo right there. Nice large animal feces. <laughs> oh, literally excited about gigantic poo. But uh, maybe we'll be able to tame one of those anklos or something that we saw earlier. Or, like, a parasaur. I think an anklo would be better. At least if we find a... Like a big vein of metal, then we'll be able to get a bunch of metal out of it, you know? I don't know how we're, uh, what, what saddle do we need for an anklo? Uh, level 36. Eh, I think so, right? Yeah, I'm like, we're nine levels away from that, so that's definitely doable, I'd say. I'm like, we could always use it as like a... We could, we, we could set it to wander, you know, and it'll, it'll like harvest crops and stuff from bushes. So we could just kind of let it just wander around. 
at least temporarily until <gasps> what is that is that an alpha heckin megalodon in the background or something there's like dust coming out of it like cheeto dust like we've seen in other series i think that's indicating it's now for you guys oh ho, might want to watch out of that jeez which one is this one level 300 okay that's a level 308 female that's still an adolescent level 700 uh stego need to be level 30 whoa so i could passively tame that thing pretty soon you guys holy heck what about passive oh yeah i'm level 40 for that one it's probably going to be tough taming that Steragosaurus passively. Because I need to follow it around, like, and taming it with heckin' uh, Mio Berries is going to be super, it's going to take forever. This is going to be the most tedious thing in the galaxy, I'm sure. Because <laughs> it's probably going to need like a trillion of them, you guys, like, holy heck. Anyways, I think I'm just going to pause the recording, continue just literally just harvesting bushes left and heckin' right. <laughs> until I get a bunch of Narca Berries and Narca Berry Seeds and stuff like that, and they will finally be able to harvest. Not farm or starm. <laughs> start our farm and uh, start actually producing narco berries and stuff instead of hacking, having to harvest them from berry bushes and stuff like this. And maybe even when I come back, I'll try and tame that level 300 ankylo or something crazy. To even get that thing casually tamed and then get like a like 150 level taming bonus from that thing. <laughs> and then maybe finally be able to use that thing to harvest a bunch of berries and bushes and stuff super duper fast. But for right now, go to pause the recording and I'll see you guys here in a bit. Hopefully, when I have a bunch of trank spears. So I'll see you guys here in just a bit. Oh, uh, you guys, it, it's been like 10 seconds since I paused. And I just looked at my inventory to offload a bunch of uh, seeds and stuff. And there's more of this stuff. I don't even remember killing a trilobite or anything. I guess you just randomly pick these up or something? I don't know. <laughs> but we got more of the potent trank arrows, toxic trank arrows, and even a toxic trank dart. Like, I don't even have a long neck rifle. And, and these tame helper times 50 reduces food 50 times faster for 30 seconds. Potent narcotic. I don't even, this might have been in my inventory before I paused. I don't know. Alpha blood, this blood from mighty alpha dino. You, what? How did I get this? Like, I'm not spawning it in because I don't even know what half this stuff is. <laughs> But it seems crazy, you guys. I should probably make another uh, bow, because that one's about to break, so... There we go. Let's make another bow. And then just, I don't know, retire that one, I suppose. I'm like, I could repair it. Let's, let's repair it. There you go. Let's repair it. That way we have two bows. Sure, why not? But, I guess... we could, Yeah, let's still go for that ankle. Or should I? I'm like that... Ah, oh, that Styrac... Am I going to be greedy? Am I going to be like, yeah, that, that Styracosaurus probably still has some good torpidity applied to it. I'm like, it might. It might. Let's, let's try it out with the... The blue ones first, because those are 18 ton. One of these arrows is like 18 of the uh, regular trank arrows, right? So this is like super duper crazy good. And then we can move to the green ones or whatever that is, right? And those ones are uh, what, like nine? Like one of those arrows equals nine of the uh, regular trank arrows. I don't know if that's the level nine or. Okay, it looks like that thing doesn't care. Oh, there's a stump over there. I got full in. <laughs> Where in the world did that uh, that one star Arachosaurus go? There's that cool iguana on that was like a weird... Oh yeah, what, what level was this one ankle right here? I think we're able to tame that, like 300, yeah, 308. Might be able to tame that here in the future. Maybe right now, I'm like, I could. Like, what's really stopping me? There's that adolescent stego, there's like an alpha megalodon or something over there. So that thing didn't die, I didn't pick up anything from that thing, clearly. I just don't know where I got this stuff, you guys. I'm like, I'm not complaining, but at the same time, like, I'd like to know how I got it so I can get more of it. Oh, I think it was- oh, is that it? Yeah, 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 that's it right there, yeah. Is this a cliff? Please tell me this is a cliff. It's not. Man. Here's a cliff right here, though. Let's, uh... Oh, I can't jump yet. Let's switch over to the regular arrows, get its attention, then switch over to the super-duper good arrows. Oh, my gosh. Should I go to the top of this hill and then shoot it and then run? Let's do it. Oh, let's go! Oh, yep, I got a hit. I heard the hit. I heard the hit. Now I've got eight of these good arrows here, you guys. Where is it? Okay, it's coming. Okay, it's coming. Let's get the, uh... Where the world, where'd I get this? Literally, you guys saw it. I didn't even do... I didn't even get... I don't think I got any messages saying, Hey, you picked up this, you picked up that. I don't think any of that happened. Anyways. There is a good shot right there. Center heckin' mass. It's coming over here now. Gotta hit right on his heckin' nose. <laughs> there you go, right on his armor plate. Oh, it's not running away just yet. It will be soon, I'm sure, right? Now, each one of these arrows, like I said, is like equivalent to what? 18 of the regular ones? So, and these are equivalent to like 9 of the regular ones? So, holy heck, just do the heckin' math. How many arrows have we basically hit it with by now? <gasps> it's stuck! Good advantageous positioning, you guys. Let's keep getting it. Ooh! Man! I don't know if it tried to attack right there or what. 
Oh my gosh, this is gonna be a fantastic team. Come on, Ada, get over here. We got three more arrows. Oh my gosh, it's run away. I don't know if it's run away from torpidity or what. Or stupidity. <laughs> Maybe I'm the stupid one. I'm like, I'm heading straight. I can towards it. It's going right towards my Eichen house. One more arrow right to the butthole. And now I'm out. Can I, oh, 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 I'm running to the cliff. Running right toward the cliff. Where I don't know where it went. I want to make some trank, uh, or, uh, oh gosh, it's chasing me. <gasps> don't tell me it knows. Oh gosh, it's going around. Oh no, it's just... <gasps> no way, no way! Yes! Fine, a heckin' least! 16,000 heckin' whatevers. Uh... Oh, here we go. Mio berries, Mio berries. Man, it lost a pretty good amount of health there, you guys. Oh my gosh. I might actually have to, like, slow-mo one trillion to, like, make this thing go faster. Like, oh my good golly gee. <laughs> what is this thing? Ramshackle Toxic Terror Bird Saddle Rafting... Ro what? What is it? Uh, oh, a Toxic Terror... Oh, is that, like, a Poison B.A.? Tox or a uh, terror bird that does like torpidity when you attack, like from uh, on like Genesis, I assume. <gasps> Did it just eat something? 0.3%, 419 level taming bonus. God heckin' Lee. This is gonna take a trillion years, even with <laughs> my heckin' uh, uh, what do you call it, like slow mo one trillion and stuff. It's gonna take massively forever, but oh my gosh. How many, uh, how many episodes, how many deaths until we finally got the thing killed or well, knocked out and hopefully maybe tamed? Do we have a set a seed for this yet? We don't. I, I think I just put up all my seeds and didn't have any Nargaberry seeds. Uh, let's see. No Nargaberry seeds. I don't think so, yeah. Yeah, no, 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 none of that. Man, that sucks. Okay, whatever. Uh, we do have, yeah, that right here. We do have that. What is it called? Like, food helper or something like that, right? Where does it go? Oh, there it is right there. Let's test this out. Do I have to, like, I hope I don't have to... What in the world? Is it like oh I thought it was I thought it was like a weird aberration meme on it, but it's just flowers. Let's read this again. Reduces food fifty times faster for thirty seconds. Ooh. So let me put that there and then I guess force feed it. Is that uh food, yeah, food is dropping right now. Holy heck. That's great. Alright, well it's eating right there. Let's put some uh, some other berries in its inventory. I, I, it's going to automatically eat the most uh, efficient one, the Miho berries. But I'm going to put other berries in there just in case it, like, runs out of Miho berries. And, uh, you know, it'll, it'll still be able to get some taming from the other stuff, you know? So, potent narcotic. That's going to be great for keeping it nice and knocked out. I'm going to keep giving it these tame helpers. Definitely. How do you make that, though? Probably super expensive. Tame helper times 50 times 100 times 500. Golly. So, to make the times 50 is 12 Zool berries, 4. This is actually pretty cheap. Like, relatively cheap. Like, we could probably make this thing pretty soon, maybe. I'm like, we are in a watery area. We might be able to find rare mushrooms, rare flowers, especially if we get them, uh, Anklo, which I definitely want to do here sometime soon. I uh, don't know if 30 seconds has passed by just yet, but probably want to give this thing a, uh, another one of those here sometime soon. Given that thing definitely, uh, boosted its taming all the way up, maybe like, I don't know, 10, I don't know what it was. I think it was like 0.7 or something like that before. I think it's still dropping right now, is it? No, it's... I'm like, it's eating at the same time, so it's hard to tell. I think it stopped. Yeah, I think it stopped. Because it it, it, it it would have eaten by now. And, oh, yep, it's eating again right there. But the food is dropping naturally right now, I believe. And if we look at the uh, unconsciousness, like, drop compared to the taming, like, progress, I don't think we need to worry about giving it any narcotics or any uh, of these toxins or whatever. I don't think we need to worry about that at all. Uh, once we do get her tame, though, definitely want to give her a small experience potion and just kind of see how helpful that's going to be here in the future, you know? Oh man, I'm super cold right now. But what from? Uh, hypothermia. What am I... Is there like a weather... This must be some sort of weather effect. Like, look at this. Everything is like all orange and stuff? And I'm like hypothermic right now. What does it say temperature-wise? 38 degrees Fahrenheit, that's just above freezing. How is it so cold? What is happening? Uh, I don't know. I don't have any pelt. Not gonna have any pelt anytime soon, so I'm not gonna have any fur armor or anything like that, but uh, let's give it another tame helper thing. Maybe I'll just randomly just... Oh, yeah, maybe I'm getting these things from uh, harvesting plants. Because I think every... each Like, both times that I got those random drops, I got them from plants, and I'm just not paying attention to that left-hand side enough. Maybe I'm getting those random, like, tame helpers and... Like, blood things? <laughs> Maybe I'm getting them from these bushes. I don't know! Because that's the only- that's what I've been doing. But I- surely I would have noticed, like, oh yeah, you picked up like four heckin' amazing tame arrows. 
from this one random bush completely out of the blue. I'm surely I would have noticed that, right? We got a Mio berries and Azul berry seeds and stem berries right now, though. Yeah, I don't think we have any Nargaberry seeds yet, right? Yeah, and still no Nargaberry seeds, unfortunately, golly. Whoa, is that a special Tyrannon? I don't know, I, I definitely need a uh, Spyglass for that, though. Check up on this taming progress. Ah, oh, man, we lost some taming effectiveness, though. But it, it, even if it had zero taming effectiveness, level 840 for a baseline is insane. It's going to be over level 1000 whenever it's done. Golly, almost at 100, but yeah, it's way past that, golly. Anyways, uh, I... Looks like it's about to lose all the Mio berries. There you go. More Mio berries right there. This is what I need to do. Just continually get more and more Mio berries. Because that's like the most efficient food. At least for right now. I know we can get vegetables and stuff in the future. But I just do not have access to vegetables just yet. All I have access to are these Mio berries. And... Oh gosh. Is it nighttime or something right now? I, like technically? I, I don't know what this weird effect is. Definitely some sort of weathery effect. Similar to a sandstorm in Scorched Earth. Some sort of weird... Like... Wasteland, like a uh, nuclear winter or something. I don't know. Like, it looks super disgusting, <laughs> you know? <laughs> but, uh, oh gosh, weird frame rate droppage right there. But, uh, yeah, I'm just going to continually harvest a bunch more of these, like, bushes. I'm still not noticing me picking up, like, random uh, arrows or anything like that. What is this? Yeah, just a regular fe female trend on. Nothing special about that. Uh, maybe I'll kill uh, more tribites. Tri if I could find any, because. Didn't we get something good from him earlier? I feel like we did. But I'm pretty sure you have to like harvest dead flesh to actually pick up their items, right? I don't think I would have. I think I would have noticed that. Hmm. I don't know. I might just. Oh yeah, it was like over there, wasn't it? Yeah, like on that beach. I think that's where we found the trilobites. Yeah. I'm going to continually get more of these like Miho berries and stuff like that, and hopefully get better uh, progress getting that thing tamed and. Maybe it'll be, uh, maybe it'll still be over level 1000 with the taming bonus once it's finally heckin' tamed. If it does get tamed, I'm like, we're in a pretty safe area, like, like, from episode 1. It's basically the same st Oh, we got, uh, vegetable seeds there, though. We got long grass. So we could, uh... Oh, it finally got a Nargaberry seed! Nice! I didn't even notice that. What is that thing? <gasps> oh, it's a jug bug. I thought it was something actually interesting. 32% <laughs> tamed, though, you guys. Let's get some more, uh, Mio berries. There you go. Noise. Uh, yeah. I guess we can give it another one real quick. There you go. So it looks like it's probably going to be like 60% or something like that one if we run out of those tame helpers or whatever they're called. So I'm like, that's, that's a pretty good head start right there. And maybe I'll find more of those tame helper things randomly. Who knows? But uh, let's put that there in Narcaberry Seed. And let's hopefully get that heckin' stuff. Uh, there you go. Get some more heckin' fertilizer there. There you go. <laughs> no more fertilizer to deposit. So we're at 16,000 fertilizer right there. Narcaberry Seed is the seedling, so it's going to take a little while for that to actually, you know, be ready to start bearing fruit, if you will. Or berries. Bearing berries. <laughs> what is this thing over here, though? Is this a special terrain on? I don't think it is. Yeah, it's just a regular one. Female, level 1, 7, 12. No, 112. Yeah, 112. Man, so I'm like, I, it, might, it might as well be 712. Like, golly. <laughs> like, I wouldn't even notice. It's basically, it's, everything over here is just insane. I don't think I've seen anything that's double-digit level just yet. Except for me, of course. <laughs> like, I'm the only thing. I'm the weakest thing in the entire map. <laughs> like, man, I need to, like, I need to, like, Pull some heckin' sliders back, make things not super high level, but then again, it, uh, it is kind of fun seeing things literally level 800 and stuff, killing us in one heckin' shot. It's definitely a change from what we're used to, right? So, anyways, I'm just going to continue to get more berries and stuff, just because I have nothing better to do with it. I, I Maybe I'll get another crop plot and plant down that uh, long grass. I don't know if I have, like, salva roots or anything like that, uh, or citronals or anything. I think the only vegetable I have this far is just the long grass, and that's going to take forever without a greenhouse to even start giving us any of those uh, corn things, so yeah, I'm just going to still rely on those Mio berries, because that's probably our best bet for right now. So, going to pause the recording, continue to get more berries, hopefully get more progress done with the Styracosaurus Tame, and I'll see you guys here in a bit, and if anything interesting happens along the way, I'll be sure to let you guys know.